Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and thank you for choosing this video. I was just thinking what to do with this with this top. Should I throw it away or should I do something? Well, in this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to do 11 cake bases using items from your house. And mainly, I'm going to be using Dollar Tree products. So guys, stick with me for you can see all of the amazing things that I have store for you. Now, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell for you can receive notifications of every time I upload a new video. So come with me for I can show you really quick. Okay guys, so what we are going to do is we're going to get these three frames in different sizes and you could find everything at the Dollar Tree, including the candle holders. So I'm going to get some black crafting paper and I am going to cut them and I am going to put them inside. You could, this is optional, you could even paint them, but I decided to to put the black paper because I am going to reuse this, um, this frames again. So, <laughs> but it totally look, looks great. As you notice, it looks awesome and you don't need to paint it. And it's super easy and super economic just in case if you don't have paint in your house and so what i'm gonna do is i am going to attach or glue in place the with wax the um the frames with these candle holders these candle holders you could also find it at the dollar tree um at this moment in the area where i live I couldn't find the clear ones, the, the crystal clear ones. So I found these and this came up so perfect because I didn't have to paint them or anything like that. So you can find them either in white or in black. And so, and this came really great for this design. And so I glue them all together. And as you see, I have the three of them together. And now I am going to uh, glue a little bit of glitter, this shiny uh, glitter. Um, and so now I'm going to decorate it with some leaf and some beads that you could also find it at the Dollar Tree. The leaves, I did find it, I, I bought it at Walmart and it totally cost me a dollar. The stem, it cost me a dollar. And so now I am going to decorate the middle part this is optional you guys I think but I think this will look really great on your bases and this base can go well with your candy and also for cupcakes and uh, anything that you would like to put in and so now I am adding another um, another piece in the last frame well, it could look different and you will see what the result came out Okay, for this second design, I bought these three trays at the Dollar Tree. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these Christmas balls that you put in the tree. And I decided to use the small ones, the mini ones for the mini tree. And so I'm gonna glue them in place. And guys, this will look awesome. And it will look totally different from any other designs. I mean, you could actually leave it like that, but I decided to put these balls and it will look great. And I basically will not tell you what to use with these trays. You could do, you could use it for anything, guys. You could even use it for uh, decorating your bathroom. You could put candles in there or even a base. Um, you could also uh, get these trays, gold and silver ones at the Dollar Tree also. And you could even um, decorate this in your room or any room, any part of the room, or even the kitchen. So it looks awesome, guys. And I added these balls and it will look great, guys. If you want it, and it looks elegant for your parties. Okay. 
Okay guys, so for this design, I'm gonna be using these bases. These bases are not long, they're actually like middle size, you know, like half size. And I'm also gonna be using this candle, but only for decoration purposes. I'm not gonna use the candle, I'm not gonna add inside any candy. And so I'm gonna use this also, this candle holders, and as you notice, they also like different sizes. I also bought those at the Dollar Tree. I also bought these uh, red beads and this green stem, I bought it at Walmart for $1. And so I'm gonna be adding all of these. I'm gonna be gluing them together, gluing them in place. And I'm gonna have different sizes, guys. I love this because you could be so creative with all these bases and you could be, you could create so many different sizes. You don't have to stick with only, we're just putting them flat in the table. And also you could, uh, instead of putting a, a, a candle inside, you could put in candy and different type of candy. You're gonna see at the end um, for you to have an idea. Now then I'm gonna be adding this ribbon, this black and white ribbon that I'm gonna be using for my house decoration this year. And I got inspired because I really like these colors and I just wanted to like make something different. And you're going to see in my next coming up video what I did with these ribbons and it looks really nice. And I'm gonna show you a lot of DIYs. So you have to stick for that video, guys. And also I wanna share this moment. I wanna thank you guys for subscribing recently to my channel. Thank you all for your support. Now I am going to be adding this green stem plus a little bit of the red beads. And it looks really nice, guys. If you decorate it, really nice it's gonna look awesome i mean these candles uh with all the decoration you could get them for like 15 dollars but guys by you doing it in your house it will be price i mean it will not be priceless of course but it will be awesome and like that you get um you get you know you can feel awesome that you say hey i did my own decoration <laughs> okay so now i'm gonna be adding these balls in these greens you know um this green i actually had it a long time in my house a long time ago so i decided hey why not to add it in this time decoration so i don't remember where i bought this green <laughs> so um yeah but look it looks nice now this one, this this big ribbon, I also bought it at Walmart. I think it cost me like around eight dollars. And so I'm gonna be adding this third green, which I don't remember when I bought it because it was a long time. And so these uh, cones, I also bought it at Walmart. I couldn't find the small ones at the Dollar Tree because they had the really cute ones in small, but I couldn't find them. If you could find it, Definitely go ahead. I, I think they give you like a pack of 12. Um, to this base, I'm gonna be using a red tape that I also bought at Dollar Tree, as you see. And I'm gonna be adding as a shape, as a, a design. And this is amazing, guys. I love the way it came out. Look at this. For this design, I used this silver plate plus this plate vase that you can also find both of them at Dollar Tree. What I do is that this uh, silver plate I painted in gold with this type of paint. And so I did this to match it out with the plate base. And you can find this at Walmart as well, except the paint. 
it's not the paint the paint i think i believe i bought it at walmart a long time ago and so what i'm going to do is i am going to glue this condo holder in place in between both bases and it will look amazing guys you don't have to spend so much money and with this you spend three dollars only and you have a base for cupcakes and or even for small cakes Now for this fifth design, I'm gonna be using two oven covers plus two Dollar Tree candle holders plus a pizza pan that you could also find in my Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna paint all the three of them in white with just regular paint in white and then I'm gonna be using a Sharpie to mark the, just to make a different look and then I'm gonna glue them all together and then I'm gonna add this uh, black and white ribbon and guys this looks amazing this will look amazing for your home DIY decor There you go and then I'm going to decorate it with some sleeves that I'm going to be adding in place and then I'm going to add a little bit a little bit of red bows, a little bit of red um, just like you see there and now what I did was that the last the part that ends on the ribbon I attach it to the plate and it looked amazing guys I mean you don't have to do it the same way that, that I did but but it would look really nice and then I added this Christmas ball this mini Christmas balls and then I added more beads and it looks amazing guys you could do whatever you want with these bases you could even put cupcakes candy anything I use it for different purposes um, but but definitely this is an idea and it would look great in your house guys if you're thinking of doing a white Christmas this year Now for this design, I'm going to be using some covers. I'm going to be using three covers and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this Dollar Tree sticky paper and I am going to glue them on top of the covers. And then what I'm going to do later on is that I'm going to paint them on the side for it could look like a real wood now it probably would not look like a real wood but at least i would try you know and then i'm gonna use brown color plus like like a lighter brown like ivory to make a look like it's like the the like the wood around is shedding or something okay so that's what i'm gonna try to do there you go I got my three pieces and then this cover I'm gonna paint it right now with with brown two color brown one in dark and one in light So then after I stick this paper on top of these covers, I am going to 
place the candle holders. I'm gonna glue them all together for I could put all of this on top of this real wood. And it would look nice for cupcakes or for anything that you would like to put on top and it looks amazing guys. Guys, I don't know if you like these cookies, but I, I absolutely am a fan and I love these cookies. So I came up with the idea to not throw away this with this cover and I could use it also as a cupcake or cake base. So I'm just gonna glue this candle holder and I'm gonna glue them on the bottom of this cover and it would look nice guys you have to use them and if you have plenty you could use as much as you want at Dollar Tree you could find these also in the different sizes okay so this would look amazing guys Now at Dollar Tree, I was able to buy this cover as well and I like it because it has a really nice shape and so I'm going to be using this tape, this red tape and I'm going to be putting like a small bow and I like it because it's sticky so it would definitely help me a lot. You don't have to use this tape, you could not even put anything on top but since it's when holidays, you know, everything is acceptable. <laughs> okay. Um, but but if you don't want this color, you could also paint it and you could spray paint them in whatever color you desire. And it will look amazing in whatever you want to use it for. And so I added these cone and also these beads and this leaf and voila, it looks really nice. And then I glue the candle holder on the bottom of this cover and voila you have another base and now for the bottom part I'm gonna be using these um, covers this bottle cap covers and what I'm gonna do the what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be painting them in green and red like using Christmas colors and then I, what I'm going to do is I am going to glue this on one of the oven covers and I'm going to be gluing them on the side and I am going to alternate one in red, one in green and so and so until I finish completely. I'm going to do this repeatedly until the end. And there you go that's how it came out and it looks nice and then I am going to glue the candle holder on the, on the bottom and then I'm gonna put this base on top and it will look nice guys look at this it looks like a cake but it's not <laughs> and so yeah you can put cupcakes you can put whatever you want and it will look amazing guys Now for this fall, I came up with this idea of using leaves and making like a, like a basket with leaves. And so um, you could use a balloon, but I decided to use a bowl, a big bowl, right? Because I wanted to have a big basket. And so I cover it, I cover the bowl with this plastic and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be using this clear glue you could use the other glue as well any kind of glue I think it, it works with this with this project and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a lot of glue like like good amount for I could glue all these 
leaves, all these fall leaves, are in the bowl. And it doesn't have to be perfect, not at all, because it will look really nice, like if you put different colors everywhere. And then I added a rope around it. I put in a, a rope around it for it look really nice and it glues well. And then I decided also before it dried, I decided to put wax around it for it could hold in place really tightly because I want to put on the, on the bottom of this um, leaves, I want to add a candle holder. So I really need this to be really strong. And so then I took off all these clear plastic and then one of, and then I used this cover of this empty formula and then I glued them all in place, everything, including the candle holder. And it looks really nice guys. By using this method, it definitely hold in place everything that I wanted to put in. And it wasn't heavy, so it really, it really helped me. So this wasn't heavy at all. <laughs> For this base, I'm gonna be using real plates that you could also find it at the Dollar Tree. You can find them really nice, including the teacups, but <laughs> I'm not gonna use teacup this time. I'm just gonna use three kind of plates, the bowl and the mini cake, the mini size, the mini size uh, plate plus the the bigger one, and then I'm gonna hold them in place just like this by gluing them with wax, and then I'm gonna glue this uh, the bowl separately. But you could pull them all together, and it will look amazing. And you or you could leave it on the side just like this, just like that. Um, for you could have like a dipping chocolate or dipping sauce or anything, whatever you wanna, whatever you wanna came up with, and it would look amazing. Now for this holidays, you could use the same this plates also that you could find them at the same store, and you could use it this way as well. This would look amazing as well. So there's different ways in which you could like use your plates and also this square one. The top one I did find it at the Dollar Tree but the bottom not. The bottom one I found it at the Walmart store and I already had this a long time ago guys so excuse me. <laughs> and for the last design I'm gonna be using these trays that you could find them at the Dollar Tree plus the glasses and then I'm gonna glue them all together and so if you notice the middle the middle part of the glasses, I'm gonna be adding this block these balls and I'm gonna be adding these squares that I also bought it at the same store. Um, because I didn't want to have this empty. But this is a cool another idea that you could do is if you don't have none of those balls or the square ones, um, the square uh, wood you could add um, dry beans or add any dry corn and it will look amazing or the a third alternative is that you could like paint them all together you could paint them all together including the tray with the glass and it will look amazing guys so yeah <laughs> Hello guys, thank you for watching. Please don't leave and subscribe for more videos and give me a thumbs up. If you have any comments, leave them in the box down below. You can also follow me on my social media. Bye for now.